What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to my final guaranteed base icon pack opening video. I have got four icons today instead of the three of last time. Last time we did this, we got three icons. We got Petit, Henri and Vieira. It was insane. Today I'm hoping for a Ronaldo, a Maradona, a Pele, a Ronaldinho, a Matthias, Blanc, Desai. I don't know, there's some great icons. Let's hope for some good ones. Now, if you guys could drop a thumbs up on the video, it'd be very much appreciated. Let's try and smash 10,000 likes for the video for today. And what I'm going to do first, guys, is we're going to move into the Mega Packs, Promo Packs. We've got eight minutes left, and then at 6 p.m., hopefully we're going to have some, um, some new Promo Packs or maybe, I don't know, some SBCs or something down the line anyway uh, that we can get into as well. So we'll start with Mega Pack number one. Of course, fuck birthday items are no longer in packs. And we get no board in Mega Pack number one. Of course, I've got to keep opening these promo packs. I don't recommend people spend money on FIFA points. It's generally the worst value for money in pretty much any game that you're going to play. You know, in FIFA, you can spend £10,000 on this game and not have all the content. Not even have a sniff of all the content. In most all other games... If you spend 10000 on it, they would probably invite you to the development team. So, um, that's a joke, obviously, but the, the, you know, the, the fact remains that if you spent ten grand on almost any other game out there, you would have most of the content, if not all of the content. FIFA, not so much. So, I don't recommend that you spend it. However, I spend money on uh, FIFA points to make sure I keep my account topped up with coins so that I can bring you videos like this of things such as you know, prime icons and uh, uh, the SBCs, the end of era stuff, the, the league SBCs, uh, all those Futmus SBCs were obviously absolutely amazing. And then the base icon upgrade now. Now, it's interesting as well. Somebody raised the point that the fact that we've got a base up icon upgrade pack to, uh, this week potentially will get the middle upgrade pack at one stage or another as we get ourselves Joshua Kimmich there. 84 rated, our first board of the day. So yeah, potentially they could do a prime icon and a, I don't know what the middle icons are called, but they could potentially uh, <clears throat> get us a pack for that too, which would be pretty sick. Let's send uh, a Rambo up to the trade pile. I should have sent Vasquez up to the trade pile as well. I forgot about that. Never mind. So two packs remaining of these mega packs and then we shall be back at 6 p.m. for, at the very least, the the icon packs and, and hopefully a little bit better. Hopefully some more promos for us to get into. So we get Trap there as our fourth player. These packs, generally speaking, so far have been pretty terrible. Um, some okay consumables. Nothing major, though. So we'll send all of that in. And now, of course, Harrit, guys, who I haven't seen as packed just yet. Harrit is no longer French. So um, I wonder if EA have changed along with his nationality's drop weight because he was packed more often than any player I think I've ever seen. So we get one board, guys, out of five mega packs. And again, it just speaks volumes about what we would consider value for money. Not only, you know, we spent 700 FIFA points per pack. So what's that? Uh, 3,500 FIFA points, which we'll go and have a look in the store. But 3,500 FIFA points is what we spent. And we got essentially nothing in terms of what content is available so if we bought 3500 fifa points it would cost us what's the closest thing uh it would cost us around somewhere around 20 pounds 20 to 25 pounds so for 20 to 25 pounds we got no no premium content we got one board player we got none of the best players we got no premium um like consumables like, just generally speaking, it was an absolute letdown and nightmare. However, it's the risk that we know we take when we open packs in FIFA. We're, we're to blame as much as ER, because, ER, as EA, because we continue to purchase the FIFA points. I'm going to wait around until 6 now, guys. We have got Man of the Matches in packs, so hopefully we get something at 6 for the Man of the Match packs. That would be pretty sick. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to wait for 6pm, guys, and I will be right back. Okay, guys, so we are back. There was nothing by way of SBCs, but of course, of course, there are some promo packs in store. Of course there are, of course. It just, why not? Why not? Hey, I, I actually rate it because I get to open them right now. So five more 25K packs to come. We opened five 35K packs and we got Joshua Kimmich as our only notable pack. And so let's do five player only packs. Premium gold player packs. Um, let's see how many times we get ourselves again your main man uh, uh, Harrit so if Harrit comes out a few times 
I wouldn't be surprised. If he comes out zero times, I actually would be quite surprised if Harrit doesn't show up at all. So pack number two, and again, no board, no man of the match, no inform, no walkout, no upgrade, no icon. We get Vasquez, who of course did have a special card a week or so ago, but obviously not anymore. And uh, there is no Harrit there, no Harrit, and I'm happy. Uh, we'll keep the 81s and up just because you never know when they're going to come in handy. Next pack, guys. Three to go before we get into these icon guaranteed packs. Come on, give us a board EA. It's just not happening for us, dudes. It's just not happening. The luck isn't in in the gold packs. Let's hope that that luck turns around in no. We got upgraded out the door. Let's hope that up, uh, luck comes around. I think that's an upgrade, anyway. Wasn't he silver earlier? He's a beast, by the way. If you look at him, like a uh, four star weak foot, six foot tall. 90 strength, 85 aggression, and although he's got low acceleration, he's got really good sprint speed, so uh, he, he's an okay player. Uh, we get Val Buena again. Val Buena's a guy that we've seen a couple of times in packs, three or four times already uh, today. Um, but yeah, um, you know, hopefully the, the bad luck in the premium gold players packs and the bad luck in the mega packs will indicate good luck in the icon packs. So we'll, uh, we'll see what we get in this one. It's going to be German center mid. Is Bastian Schweinsteiger. Um, all the 74s. Oh, Capcom Tom would love that for FIFA Bingo, wouldn't he? 374s, the triple stat is absolutely perfect. We get the new Barcelona Mina card as well, uh, which is okay, I guess. So, four uh, 25k packs, no special card, no board or anything so far. Of course, five mega packs, only the one special card. And that is five in a row, guys, with absolutely nothing available to us. We are going to get ourselves Z Zielinski. Zielinski indeed. So uh, there you go. Zielinski is our player on that one. In fact, I don't, did we even get an 82 rated card out of those? I can't even remember. I know we got a few 81s, um, but I don't even think we got an 82 out of five premium gold player packs. And that leaves us, guys, with four base icon players. Now, if I do get a duplicate base icon player, uh, like a, a duplicate icon, I will dump them into an icon SBC and retrieve a 100k pack for doing so. And then we'll open that 100k pack as well. So here we go with icon number one. EA, let's be someone big. Hullet, Pele, Maradona, Maldini. Argentinian, left back is Zanetti. Do I already have Zanetti? I don't know. I think I already have his... Do I have Zanetti? I actually think I do have Zanetti. 87 Zanetti. This is a good card too. For some reason, I've got a feeling I have him. I do have him. Now, do I have him untradeable? I do have him on trade, so I'm going to go and send him into an icon SBC, guys. I will be right back. Okay, guys, so I have traded in um, one Javier Zanetti. We have got one 100k pack available to us. Looks like I have some items to deal with. We'll send the new Zanetti into the club, and we get a bonus 100k pack. Always nice, and obviously helps uh, start building towards some of the icons that I haven't done. We do get a board, finally. Maybe it's a big player, maybe it's not. Let's see what it is. Italian. Goalkeeper. Oh. So this is our 100k pack. At least we got a board, I suppose. Is that something decent? We got three, three eighty. Wait, three or four eighty threes in there. So it's better than nothing, I suppose. Uh, was there a Harriet in there? I don't recall seeing him, but he might have been. Um, but never mind. So three more icons to go, dudes. Let's hope that we get no more duplicates. I would like to have some uh, some players that I haven't seen already. We're going to get ourselves icon number two. It's going to be French Cam. So is, is this Blanc or Petit? Not Petit. Uh, Pires, sorry. Yeah. So we get Robert Pires. That is now the fourth Arsenal Frenchman that we've packed in the last five icons. We got Vieira. We got Petit. We got Henri. We now have Robert Pires. This icon card is horrific. I mean, truly horrific. Um, four star, four star is nice. Six foot two is nice. But I mean, just look at these stats. No strength, low stamina, very average dribbling, very average passing, very average shooting. Like, what a terrible card, honestly. This doesn't represent Pires, in my opinion, in any way, shape, or form. But Robert Pires there is our icon number two, icon number three. I wouldn't mind seeing a German or a Brazilian flag. Show me the Brazilian flag. Even if it's Roberto Carlos, even if it's, um, you know, the baby Ronaldinho. It's Dutch. Centre mid, centre forward, Burkamp or Van Basten? Is Van Basten a centre forward? Dennis Burkamp. There's another Arsenal player, guys. That's our fifth ex-Arsenal icon in six packs. Now, this card, I actually rate. It's not 
insane on the levels of icons, but it's definitely up there. Four star, four star as well. Six foot tall, so nice and tall, but 97 composure, fantastic ball control, which I think is very relevant in this game. Good short passing and good vision, probably very similar to Petit, uh, to Pires is actually, but just much better shooting, you know, 95 positioning, much better finishing, much better shot power, uh, not much better finishing actually, I think Pires had some okay finishing, but this is just all round a much, much better card in my opinion. And there we have another Arsenal icon. I don't even think there are any Arsenal icons left to go. Who are we missing from Arsenal? I can't even remember. But this is our final icon of the video, guys. Can we hit a big one, EA? Come on, let's get Pele, Maradona, Ronaldo, Ronaldinho, someone huge. It's Dutch again. It's goal kick. No, no, don't do it to me, EA. It's Van der Sar. I, I would have been happy with Hullet. I would have been happy with um, Van Basten, you know, but no. We get Van der Sar. He, he literally looks, he looks in his picture like he's 11. And he looks in his like character standing next to his picture like he's 111. Um, but we get Van der Sar. So, four icons, guys. I mean, that was rough. Burkamp, the only reasonable icon. But even then, I think all four of those icons are at the lower bottom tier of value. I think they're all about 350 to 360,000 coins. I don't think anyone is of exceptional value out of those icons. This, though, is going to be the end of the video for today. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like, rating, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. But for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.